using is a Telfar bag. I'm sure everyone has heard about the Raid. Um, so Telfar bag is, is a black owned brand, black owned designer. Um, these bags I believe have been out, out since 2014. However, um, around 2020, 2021, they um, switched the way that you can actually buy these. I believe you could buy them like in Nordstrom. And now, well, tell far he moved it to an online thing. And I'm sure you have seen Beyonce carrying one of these two. It's just white. So the bag itself has two shop top like candles so you can just carry it in your hand. And then it also has two long straps that you can use to carry it on your shoulder or as a crossbody. Um, me, for work, I typically just carry it on my shoulder. Um, but all right, this bag is vegan leather, so not real leather. Um, it is price point is about 150 to 257 i believe the size bag that i have right here is a medium and it's called the medium shopping tote um, i also have a large um shopping tote that i use it's in the color cobalt and i use it as like a carry-on that's how big it is um and i've had that for a couple for um, but it, the wear is pretty good on it. It does, um, like if you get any marks or anything on it, they tell you to wipe it off with like a damp cloth. So I will say it is good with that. The only thing that I do not like about this bag is that it is not structured. So I'm not sure if you can see, but it's like, you know, put anything in it and it like sinks. Oh. So as far as obtaining one of these bags, you can either purchase the bag um, through their bag security program, or you can wait and just wait till he, till Far Clemens announces when his bag is gonna drop. Um, I've purchased both of my bags um, each way. Um, I do recommend though, if you are gonna do it on the day of the drop and just wait like that, I recommend going through Clarina simply because it's faster. You already have like your um, your phone number in there, your, your card information, your shipping address, billing address. So it cuts out a few steps. So you're able to get in, check out, and check out faster. Um, so yeah, as far as the bag security program, I like the bag security program because it is guaranteed. So you can go and order however many bags you want and how um, in any color that you want. You can order multiples. The only thing, is, and you purchase right then, the only thing is, is that it takes up to about six months before you start receiving the bag. But it is guaranteed. So you're guaranteed to get the color that you want, the specific size that you want, and they all are, um, the prices, regardless whether you do the bag security or wait the same day, regardless the prices for the bags are the same. Still that 150 to 257, 257 price range. All right, so the first thing in my bag, I'm actually gonna leave my bag sitting over to the side because it's heavy, is I have a heating pad. Um, I work in the hospital. I'm sure you know it gets, it's freezing cold, especially at night. I swear that they think like we, um, they keep it cold because they think it's gonna make us stay up. However, it works the opposite. Um, so yeah, my heating pad to stay warm. Um, we can't use heaters, so I was like, maybe I'll try out the heating pad thing. Next, ooh, the stuff is all tangled up. Next in my bag is my Cardiology 4 Litman Stethoscope. Um, black on black, love it. My mom actually got this for me for Christmas last year because it was the one thing on my Christmas list that I wanted and she got it in grade for me. So I do recommend if you are um, a nurse or a nursing student, get your stuff in grade because people like to steal. And then I also have this um, 
little charm on it as well, just as another, another identifier so that I know that it's my stethoscope. They can take, if someone tries to take it, they can take it off, but my name is engraved on it. And it says my first and last name and RN on it. The next thing in my bag is a charger. So this is, I always need a charger. I always carry one because if I might need it, somebody else might need it. Um, sometimes we do have a unit charger, but you can't always find those. Sometimes they get taken. Um, we do also have charges, I believe, for patients, but again, sometimes those get taken. So I just always keep it personal. The block is an Apple, um, the Apple plug USB, the regular size, or USB-A, I believe it's called, and the cord, US, um, the cord is from, I think Walmart, I said. Yeah, I think it's from Walmart. Oh, and, and I think that's a Walmart brand. Yeah. But it comes in handy, whether it be for me um, to charge my phone or my AirPods. Next in my bag, I have these Colgate Whiffs, which these are clutch. You know, once you're talking for a long time and after you eat, you know, your breath kind of gets a little stink. So you got these, brush your teeth, and they have a um, nice little pick on, on the um, end of it. So and the bag isn't that big, and you can actually take them out, um, but they're not individual, um, like packaged individually. So I just keep the whole pack instead of just taking some out. Cause in case somebody else wants one, it's in its original packaging versus it being in a sandwich bag or something like that. Next thing in my bag, I have these crystal light packets. So I've been trying to cut out on um, drinking um, energy drinks. So I've been trying to do like this, the, what is the brand? I believe it's True North, like the seltzer um, energy drinks. And then one of my coworkers actually told me about the Crystal Light um, energy drink, well, the Crystal Light packets and how they have caffeine in them. So he recommended this flavor. It's the peach mango flavor. Um, and he also recommended a lot of them. But he said this was his second. I tried the first one that he recommended, but he said this one is his second favorite. And I must say, I think this one is my favorite. I love it. It is a little sweet, so what I do is I dive, like pour a whole packet in, and I use a big, like, 40 ounce cup, fill it with water and ice, and then I drink it down about halfway, and just keep filling it with water to kind of help with the sweetness. The next thing is some lotion. This is um, a little bottle of lotion that I got from the patients. Um, it's what we give the patients, hand and body lotion. Um, I needed lotion one day and yeah, I just went in the supply room and grabbed the bottle. In this black case right here, these are my goggles. They are prescription because I cannot see without glasses and I cannot do contacts. So these are my prescription goggles. I use these like when I have a COVID patient or Anything that um, is an airborne or patients on airborne precautions that require me to have goggles or face shield, I use these. Um, one, because they prevent the face shield, sometimes can fog up. Now, face shield doesn't, face shield covers your whole face, versus these just cover right by your eyes. But the um, face shield, especially when you're drawing labs, can, and you know, you're drawing. But the um, face shield, especially when you're drawing labs can, and you know, you're dressed in all of the precaution, it gets hot and you can start sweating or you know, the face shield can start fogging up. So for me, I bought these to kind of help and they actually do work really, really well. Um, especially when it comes to like drawing blood and I have to get it on a patient that's on airborne precautions simply because obviously if the face shield is fogged up, then how am I gonna see the sticky to draw your blood, you know? 
So yeah, I do recommend these. These glasses, these ones came from Zen, I think Zenny. Yeah, so these are prescription, they came from Zenny, but they do have multiple um, sites where you can order these with and without prescriptions. And there's also a little cloth in here that I use. This particular cloth, I only use it to clean um, these glasses, because like I said, airborne patients. Um, I do have another cloth in here that I use for like my regular regular glasses. So this pouch right here, it is my pencil pouch. I got this from Target. Um, my previous pencil pouch was uh, kiddish, so I wanted to upgrade it to a little bit more stylish. So it's like alligator embossed with gold hardware. So in here I had the little post-it page tags. Post-it notes. These are my trauma shears. I actually got these on Amazon and they are, are black. These come in handy too. I have a bunch of pens and pencils and Sharpies. I'm a big pen person. Um, I love pens. They have to write a certain way and they have to click. Um, but I love pens. You know that when they say like, nurses steal pens? Yes, we do. Um, and then these three little cacti pens, I got these from work and they actually write really, really good. Um, they're gel pens, so I use them like when I'm doing my like updates or to-do lists. When I'm, you know, writing updates for report, I'll use these because it's black, it's neutral, or any task that I have to do, I use these black. And they, I, they all write black, but they're gel pen and the gel pen is so smooth. Then I have one of the nurses made these for us because we use the computer on wheels. So they have like individual drawers within them. Um, so she made these little name tags or well number tags for us to use so that we can put them in our cart so we know what room or what patient's med is what or which meds go to what patient or what room number. So that was really sweet of her. The next thing I keep in here is my iPad. I actually am in the pro well, I have a new um case that I'm about, that I am about to order from Amazon. So it won't be green anymore. Green is my favorite color, however. Um, so yeah, this is my iPad. I use this sometimes. I bring it with me, try to bring it with me every um, shift that I work, simply um, because if there's a little bit of downtime, then I use, I edit my YouTube videos on my iPad. It's just so much easier for me than trying to edit it on my phone because it's a small writing. It's just like, it's a small screen. Um, and then it's so much easier than bringing my laptop with me because it's heavy. So yeah, my Next in here is, this is one of the, well, this is actually a mask that I got from work. This is a level three mask. So level three just means it's super, super thick. So it's like three layers. Um, so yeah, I work a lot of weekends and I work night shifts. So when I come in Friday night, we usually don't have any for night shifts. So I usually try to steal well, not still, but grab when I'm coming in and I'm coming in during the week, grab like one to three of these. Next, this is my planner. This came from Walmart. Um, actually, my mom gave it to me because I was in the, we broke, both were in the process of looking for a 2022-2023 planner. Um, and I realized that my planner that I had, my happy planner actually um, ends in de this December. So I like it because it's like a regular eight and a half by 11, like a regular sheet of paper. So I have some, I have a happy planner and that is big. 
Um, and this also gives you a space to put like all of your passwords and stuff in there, even though, as you can tell, I don't use it. It still has the plastic on it. And it is, this is my inside of my planner. I actually like decorated it and I like to write in, um, different colors but this is what like the average page looks like if you don't decorate it or anything and it's in my favorite color green 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 next in my bag is a little canister of Dove hand cream. I love this because it's super, super thick. You know, you wash your hands using hand sanitizer very often. Your hands get really dry and they can crack. So this is a thicker, um, moisturizing hand cream than the one that I got from the hospital. That is like thin. Um, but yeah, I actually need to kind of re-up because it's only about a half a thing in here. So now we're making our way to the small pocket that is inside of the Telfar. So it's one big compartment and then you get like a little zip up compartment in the um, in the bag. I also forgot to mention, I think in the small bags, you don't get that zipper. I think it's just the medium and then the large where you get the zip up extra pocket. So in here, of course I have, cause you never know, got some pads. This is my ID bag. This is my badge to get inside of the building, um, inside the Pixis, Pixis room, because it's a automatic lock, so your badge, it, it unlocks everything for you. Um, and my little badge for you, I'm not sure if you can see it. But this is what it says. And then this RNBSN sticker or card that's right here, I got this from Amazon. So I get a lot of questions about this um, just from other nurses when they see it. I was like, where did you get this from? Amazon. So go check it out. I'll try and link it below if I remember. These are my AirPods. And I always keep these in here. And they're actually charged and ready to go. These are my AirPod Pros. And it's like. This is, next is this other cleansing cloth that I use to clean my glasses with. Um, I use this, like I said, for my regular glasses. I have one specific for my goggles and this is like my regular glasses then I have some tums don't know you don't know I have acid reflux but also to you know we eat I work night shifts so we typically eat late at night so with that being said a lot of times acid food doesn't agree with us so I have some tums for me or for anybody else who might need it I have a turkey in here, as you know. Welcome to me now. Well, it smells good. This is Valentino for Safe The next thing in here are my beats. These are the Beats by Kim ones in the color Earth, and I love these. I wasn't sure about the skin color, the tone matching my skin color, but it's pretty much it, like it looks really good. I think if I would have got the other ones, I think if it's Dune, they would have been too light. Let's get dry wearing a mask. Do it 
it's a so this is the chapstick that I use. I actually like this brand. It's a silky Swedish beeswax lip balm. Um, this is actually my favorite like over the counter chapstick. Um, all of the other ones they make my lips break out and swell. So those lip balm the one that doesn't get me. Then I have a little Anastasia Be Beverly Hills um, brow gel. Just because sometimes, like I said, I wake up early or wake up late actually for work and have to run out of here and don't put on any ounce of makeup or brush my brows. So I always keep a little one in here. This is a, I believe, a trial size of it. It's just to smooth down my eyebrows so I won't be looking so, so crazy. And then the last thing in here is my Laneige lip mask. I love this. I have a the, the lip gloss, but I have no idea where it is. But this sleeping mask, I use it all the time. Like literally you apply it and you don't have to apply it again. I love it. It's so worth, I think it's like $18. I got this from Sephora, I believe. Yeah, Sephora. It was like $18, but definitely worth the money. All right, guys. Well, if you have made it to the end of my video, thank you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and share. Um, we're trying to gain more followers over here. Thank you to those who have supported me and who have followed me and shared commented. Um, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.